Good morning, guys. I'm trying to wake up. It's a really long night. But the hurricane's passed. Look at this yard. <laughs> the pool's full. Oh, the bushes are down. Oh, our fence. Our fence is down. The fence is down. <sighs> but we're gonna head to Alex's house because we just got a call. Uh, he said his house is ruined. So we're gonna go down there and see what we could do. I was worried about that. This whole brand guy is like Nipa huts. So anyways, let's get down there and see how bad it is. Bad. Every banana tree is down. <laughs> this cow was just sitting outside all night, I guess. Look at that. All the trees are down. steel or whatever it's called yeah oh I'm my god we just ran over the electric line you're going to go drive oh. on the highway the mango trees are falling down it's going to take forever to clear the road oh my god that's the so food. we're having a hard time just getting to alex's village there's three little roads that oh my god look at this electric Raining really hard again, but so is this the road? Yeah. So there's three little roads that goes to Alex's village, and one is by Finn's house. That's probably the easiest one because most of it's paved, but you have to. We would have to walk through a river because the bridge is out to get to Alex's house. And then the next one is Alex's main road. It's so bad on a good day that we don't even like going down there. But right now, there's just no way. It's like a river, his road. And then it's it's a little tiny road and just trees everywhere. So there's trees blocking it and everything. So now we're trying another road. Uh, we're just gonna go as far as we can. And then we'll walk the rest of the way in the rain. I wish we would have brought umbrellas and towels. But... No. This isn't no. like a road that is going to get cleared anytime soon. No priority. Look at that. Oh my god, Fire. look at this power line. The electricity is going to be out a long time. I think we can go on our dirty. <coughs> I'm not sure if we can go to Puyas place. Line. Yeah, do you see the power lines, guys? It's close to the. No, this one is like. This is gonna get rough. All these power lines fell on the. Or all these trees fell on these power lines. It's gonna be out forever. Oh my god, is that, is that one in front of me? Yeah. There's a power line. I don't know if we can get any farther. Let's get out and talk to this guy. Yeah, well. You'll hold that for us? Yes. Thank you. We try to get to this uh, village here. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Chief. Thank you. He's holding that internet cable or whatever this is on the ground. There's so, a lot of cables though. <clears throat> I don't know how far we're gonna get because that's the main road. And now we're getting off into the 
the back road. Hey, look at this tree. It's huge. Oh my God. Two, three. Oh, look. They hit those huge trees missed that house by like... No, they didn't even miss it, actually. I don't know how we're... Somebody already chopped this one. Somebody already chopped it so they could get to the... Get past. Yeah. Just, like, leave our car somewhere. yeah, we're gonna leave it. We'll go as far as we can. I don't know how we're getting past this one. Okay, I'm going to go out that way. You're gonna get out. And... You're going to go there, oh? Yeah. It's not. I don't think there's any power to it. Do you guys see that? What Just make sure I don't hit it. Ah. Well, I was worried about this line across the thing, but I guess this tree, this tree is not going nowhere. Uh, well, look at the rest of the road down there. It's so bad as well. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is as close as we could get, so we're just going to park here and try to walk down there. You can hear chainsaws and stuff, because this whole road is blocked. I don't even know if we can walk down this road, because I just saw a whole bunch of trees down. <clears throat> but actually, we have a long way to walk. You need to I'm scared what we're going to find, because if Alex's house is down, his is the strongest house. And that whole village was full of trees, so... <laughs> Ask if we could just pass. <clears throat> so the military's down here and they said we can't even pass. They won't let us walk. A huge tree is down. This is not a good sign. There's Alex's car. Crushed. Ah, uh, Alex. Is it just this top or the roof? Yeah, it's <laughs> everything. Hey, Alex. <laughs> If you wanted firewood, you could have just asked. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, the car, the car is no good. It's still working. What do you mean it's still working? Huh? You can, you can start. It can start, but you can't, you can't shut the door and you can't no. put your head in there. No. <laughs> Maybe I can make something to, uh, So were you were you guys inside the house when the tree fell down? Yeah. We're there. Then I, I do a talk with you. Bring my uh, family there on the other side. <laughs> so you just moved to the other side of the house? Yeah. We had to extend it one day. Of all the houses I thought yours was the strong one, but then the tree fell down. Yeah. I was thought that uh, it's okay. Maybe it's okay. But already uh, proposed some uh, Prepare for in case it drops and fall down. Oh, what about uh, your uh, antenna? Patai. It's gone. Gone. Also. Oh my God! Let's look around, eh? <laughs> look at this big thing. Fell on Alex's house. Just one limb. It could have fell on that house though. That would have killed somebody. Uh, Today, last night you were screaming and crying like a little girl because you heard uh, our roof make a noise. Imagine, imagine if you're inside this house, it's like Shy, Shy and Alex inside this house. You imagine how scared you'd be. You were freaking out last night in our house. I collapsed. I think. Sad. 
Hey Shay. Hello. So were you scared last night? Yeah. Was it uh really loud? Yes. The trees go down. And... The tree? Yeah. Did you hear it squish the car? Yeah. It's loud, I bet. Uh, Judea was crying at our house because the roof made a little. <laughs> so I can't imagine if she was here. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna like collapse, I think, and cry, and then I don't know. I'm going to question Lord why, <laughs> what happened? This is a really long ordeal for how many yeah. hours? Yeah. We tried to drive here, but all the roads are blocked. Yeah. We walked from the uh, Silver Reef. <laughs> <coughs> so the pigs, uh, the pigs survived? Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's see. So you just, you wanted a convertible, huh? <laughs> Was it uh... So you guys just run to this side of the house and sleep on the other side? No, just only there. Yeah? <laughs> All five of you? Oh my god. I bet it's... Did uh... We, we tried to drive here and all the roads are blocked. The big trees everywhere. Yeah. yeah, there is a post here in Highway Bar. Mm -hmm. like, yes. Yeah, uh, um, a big tree also. Yeah, no. many, many, many. Yeah. All the way from post. Silver oh. Reef. Yeah. Like 20, 30 trees. Big ones. <laughs> and all the power lines gone. <sighs> Man. I don't know. I'm speechless just in oil because I experience not that not not the same as this one but the one that the i leaking. experienced is like the water yeah i'm glad the water no no flood here no water no water that's good just a stupid tree huh stupid tree and wind so what's first so i have to fix this one here yeah that one everything here that one also because we had to sleep here on this side. Yeah. That side will be. Uh, so that. Who, whose bedroom was this over there? Uh, Shay and then. You guys were you guys were sleeping over there? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Just the bed. Uh, just So now all five of you are sleep here. So we have to go right here. What what is it? You need uh, this metal. Uh, whatever it's called. Yeah. Corrugated steel or something? Yeah. Is that what that is? Yeah. You know where to get that? Yeah. What about the wood? Is it? Yeah. What else? Yeah, just get up some wood. That one. Does somebody have a car that you can <laughs> yeah. drive? Yeah, I'm too. The peanuts car. I can no, you oh, can yeah. go through it. Huh? Oh, it's <laughs> the, ro wood. the roads are blocked. Yeah, maybe you can go this way. No, there's another like. Uh, I can't even. Way. I can't even walk, let alone drive. Oh, okay. All the uh, trees. It's like it's like your tree across the road like twelve times. Oh, okay. This one, this one, this one. We walk from Silver Reef. Oh, okay. Yeah. But. Yeah. I don't know. Or maybe I can pick it up. I borrow some. Uh, another the car there. Right. Yeah. You can borrow my car, but it's not big enough. Yeah, I had to have some open there. Maybe we could put it on the roof. So you guys, you guys really went filming on the pier? Yeah, we uh, filming on the pier. <laughs> you didn't have to, I feel bad, you didn't have to go film for me. Yeah. But we couldn't, uh, yeah. I didn't think it was that bad. Yeah, uh, it's not, the, the waves, it's not bad. The waves? Yeah. You can still We were mostly worried about the water. Yeah, but. The uh, flooding. Flooding, no. It's not too much rain, it's, it's all wind about is wind, it's very strong. Yeah. yeah. And then you guys are... You saw Finn when you're out filming? Yeah, I saw Finn. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What did you just say? You were you were sitting here? Yeah, I was sitting here because we have some typhoon, so I just sit there. I don't want to sleep. I need yeah. my family to sleep, to relax, and then when the uh, tree. tree was pulled down, so... I, I throw my phone and go, <laughs> go inside to pick it up my family yeah to bring it out and then uh make it safe safety first were the kids know. screaming yeah it was loud i bet so, huh? yeah 
Was it loud when that tree cracked? Yeah. yeah. Especially with the hit the rope. Oh yeah. So it's very loud. The Where where's the antenna? Yeah, it's there. Oh, I didn't see that. So, really so you're you're. I bet I bet Rebecca was scared too. Yeah. She was screaming. Yeah. So I tell her just relax. Be <laughs> okay. So as long as you're okay. So the house is okay. The car is okay. We break because we yeah. can. Sooner or later we can save money to buy that one. But not the not yeah. the family. Yeah, not the family. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's the uh, my priority. Family first. Yeah. Well, uh, so did you get did you sleep at all today? Last no. night. No. No. I did not go sleep. I was do like conscious about yeah. Yeah, yeah. more trees. Yeah, more trees. They're everywhere, huh? Yeah. Uh, yeah. This, this is the hard thing. Yeah. I know. How did it get so mangled? Yeah. What the hell? Yeah. How do you bend that? More, more Filipinos with hatchets can can do more than two lazy Americans with chainsaws in a day. The whole village just uh, shows up to help whoever needs it first. I mean, look at all this. I guess I got firewood, but and cow feed. I have a heart attack. Alex and all these guys up there chopping on a tree that's hanging on a roof and their little sandals. Somebody falls. My clo the closest car is mine, like a mile away through the jungle. Can I see that? Yeah. Oh, here you go, hero. <laughs> the hero. Oh, wash it, wash it first. <laughs> Somebody was in that house. The wind didn't take it out. The floods, nothing. Just this tree. Today, look at this power line. I didn't even see this. <laughs> this power pole. Look at the baby ducks. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Oh, this power pole just snapped. <laughs> How are you? Selfie, selfie. <laughs> selfie. So it's the next day, and yesterday was one emotional day, man. I've never seen Alex like that. He's always the one helping everybody else. And he was just so... Not worried about his house or car, not being able to afford any of that. But just so traumatized that his family was like almost killed. You know, if that wall hadn't, hadn't stayed up, they definitely would have, you know. So, yeah, I went around, I got some uh, donations, me and Finn, or well <laughs> so I went around talked to some people they want to help the village because we counted about 10 other uh, houses that got destroyed and today me and Finn are going to get the metal you know the metal corrugated steel whatever that stuff's called to fix Alex's house we're just gonna buy it for him and and then like two by fours or whatever he needs to rebuild the roof and then we got somebody coming to look at the car and uh, 
appraise it, whatever you call it, to see how much it's gonna cost to fix. And then hopefully it's not too much, but we could probably replace the whole car for about $1,500. So uh, shouldn't be too bad. So if you guys wanna help, that'd be awesome. I'm not asking for help, but the whole village is, it's destroyed. So um, I'll leave my email and my PayPal in the links below. But well, right now we gotta get it sorted out. He can't be sleeping in the rain with three kids and a wife. So we're gonna go get the metal and fix his roof. I'm gonna leave this video here and uh, leave it off here and start again tomorrow. See you.